Hey, hey, my friends. Welcome back or welcome if you are new and welcome to another What's for Lunch video. First of all, <laughs> I am coming to you from my car because I'm getting ready to go down to the store and I needed to get this filmed and my eyes are watering like crazy. But <sighs> I had a, such a great time filming that last one for you that I went ahead and got you another one. And this week I have four lunches that I... um either made or recreated from leftovers that I had at home or it was just straight leftovers used the same way. So I really hope you all enjoy this video. If you do, you know, give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment below. Um, think about subscribing because I would absolutely love to have you as part of my YouTube family. And also if you have any lunch ideas or something that is tried and true for you, um, let me know in the comments below. Um, so I can try those out if it's something, you know, that I know we'll eat or my family will eat or something like that. I can always put that in my video as well. And I really, really just want to say thank you all for the love and the support. Um, the last one did pretty well on here. So I'm hoping that continues <laughs> because I just, I want to make stuff that you all enjoy. Um, I enjoy it as well, but... I mean, I'm recording it for you all, so that is the whole point behind it. So I really do hope that you all love this series, or at least like it, just a little bit. <laughs> um, I figured, you know, why not film it? Like I said in the last one, because I'm already making it. I've got to eat lunch, because um, sometimes I don't always eat breakfast, so I have to eat something. Um, some days you'll see that I don't have anything on here if... Um, if I'm eating the same thing, which I did on this one, so you'll see it in here. It's the Mississippi chicken one that I took. I had two days prepped for that, so I just had that, I believe. I, I don't know what days it were, was. <laughs> my days run so fast together, it is not even funny. I really wish my eyes would stop watering. But if you do see like a day or two missing, that would be why if I take multiple days of the same like leftovers or stuff because I do not like to waste food and we all know how expensive stuff is right now so there is no sense in wasting um but yeah so if you have any quick ideas you know something different I like watching these types of videos on YouTube as well so I can get other ideas so hopefully my videos give you some ideas too but um I'm trying to think I know, I know lunches can kind of get boring, and for me, I don't know about for you all, I've heard a couple people of my friends on here say that lunches are actually harder than um, dinners for them, and that's true, but sometimes I struggle with dinners too. So, like I said before, if you have any lunch ideas that you love or that you would take, um, just drop it in the comments below. Give me some other ideas and hopefully it can help me out and then I can help you all out or anybody else that is watching this video. But anyways, enough of the rambling. I need <laughs> to get off here and get down to the store. But like I said, if you do enjoy this series and this video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below and think about mashing that bell and becoming part of my YouTube family. All of these things helps my channel tremendously and I just, I don't know, I just, I love, I love doing this. I love filming these videos so I would love to have you as part of my family as well. But anyways, like I said, enough with the chit chat and the jumbo jumbo whatever mambo jumbo. <laughs> Let's get on down to the store and we're gonna get in to a what's for lunches. Come on, let's go. Alright, so first up is chicken salad lettuce wraps, and then I just served this with a um, some of the tortilla, tortilla chips. <laughs> Those things are so good. Um, and then I just made some of that Fiesta ranch dip right there, which is just sour cream and a packet of that Hidden Valley ranch dip mix. And then there is some of my chicken salad from a couple days ago, and of course my romaine lettuce, and then I just put all that together and made this quick and easy lunch. So I hope you enjoyed this idea because it was delicious. Okay, and 
for the second meal this week, I just took leftover Mississippi chicken and some taters with me to the office. This was so good. If y'all have never tried Mississippi chicken, I highly recommend you make it. Um, I put the link to it in my last What's for Dinner. So if you're interested in how I made that, please go back and watch that. It was part of the cookbook, or not cookbook, I've got that on my brain. It's part of the Summer Crock Pot collab um, that um, Tam and Kat and myself done. So if you're interested in that, go check that out because... It was delicious and I just had that with a side of taters and y'all it was pretty good and I actually took this for two days this week that's why you only see four days of meals um, like I mentioned in the intro so if you ever see that that's why but yeah I took this for two days that's it's so good so so good <laughs> But this lunch recipe or idea was probably my favorite lunch this week. So I had some leftover carne asada and the cilantro lime rice for, for um, I had made that for dinner, you know, in my what's for dinner. So I just took the leftover meat and rice and that's what's in this little container right here. And of course, I just served it up with some avocado and some of those tortilla chips and a the Fiesta um, ranch dip again and some salsa but I'm gonna tell you what these little things were spot on let me just put it that way they were so delicious but it just kind of gives you another idea of how to redo a um, dinner and then you know make it something different leftover makeovers And last but not least, I took some of the creamy pasta bake and I just um, took it in a bowl. So quick, simple, easy peasy, lemon squeezy here. <laughs> I do take leftovers quite a bit if I have leftovers, I should say it that way. But um, it just helps save on money. Um, you're, so you're not spending extra for lunches and dinners. So we just kind of do with what we have here and it's always delicious uh, in my opinion i think leftovers especially like pastas or lasagnas they get better as they you know the days go by let me just put it that way if they last <laughs> but i just heated this up and i served it with some of those little um bread rounds so that was my lunch this day and it was absolutely delicious Alright y'all, that is it for this week's What's for Lunches. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. It was so nice to have y'all here. And if you do, hit that like button, leave me a comment below, and subscribe. And I will see y'all on the next one. Love y'all. God bless. Bye.